Hello everyone, welcome to Urbanscape Bangalore and in this episode, I will be taking you through a small plant haul. So I happened to visit the nursery today and I was planning on splurging and spending on some of my favorite garden plants. So as a gardener, I don't really repeat my plants, so I kind of go to the nursery to buy some new plants. And so here they are and this video will not really cover a detailed description of how to take care of these plants and what they are all about but I will just be kind of explaining and introducing these plants uh, probably I will cover all these plants in detail in another video so let me first introduce you to the Royo tricolor so this is a beautiful plant with a purple tinge below the leaves and it is a lovely drought tolerant plant and I got this for 50 rupees and next we have the Kalanchoe or the Kalancho, whatever you feel like calling that's perfectly fine so here I have a pink as well as an orange colored Kalanchoe so another important tip while getting your Kalanchoe's home is that do not bring a Kalanchoe home that has not completely bloomed and it still has some closed buds. So this is a small tip that I have to give you because the Kalanchoe generally gives out blooms and it does not bloom after that. It is a photoperiodic plant like the poinsettia so it needs a lot of conditions for it to rebloom. So I will probably cover that particular aspect of this plant in another episode. So for now, you just need to remember that when you go to the garden center, make sure that you find or you select your Kalanchoe or your Kalanchoes with closed buds. Next, we move on to the orchid. So here I have a magnificently colored orchid plant. It has a pale green color with a yellow tinge in between and it's an absolute visual treat. So whenever you go select your orchids, make sure that the orchids have some life or show some life in them because generally what happens is that the nursery guys do not really know how to take care of it. They kind of put a lot of elements or they do not use the right pots or the right growing medium. So make sure that the roots are green majority of the roots are green and you see signs of life like a new shoot coming out with out of the orchid etc so i am telling you this because it cost me around 500 rupees this is the most costly plant that i bought today hence when you spend a lot you need to take care of all these things next next we move on to the garlic wine so this is a beautiful whining plant trailing plant and it is called the garlic wine exactly because the flowers smell like garlic and some people actually substitute this for a real garlic while preparing some dishes so it's an exquisitely beautiful plant it is very beautiful to look at as well and it serves a lot of purposes at the same time so the next time when you're talking to a person and you have a garlic wine next to you then do not think that the person has a garlic breath so now we move on to another plant this is the lemon coral sedum so this is actually a repetition but i love this plant it is an accent plant which accentuates the look of the other plants this is a succulent uh, hence please make sure that you use this in arrangements where you use succulents so apart from the plants that I purchased today, I also purchased something else. So that something else is a huge ceramic container. So this is that ceramic container. It has a huge pot with a ceramic container or a post. So this is not something that you would have not seen in my earlier videos. There is another container that I have which looks exactly similar to this. I was fortunate enough to find uh, an exact same replica of this container. So I was just passing by the road and I found this gypsy family which was selling a lot of ceramic items and I 
kind of bargained really well and got this for 800 while they were charging this for around 1500 so this is a small overview of what i do generally on my holidays and uh, you know spending a lot of money kind of makes you a little jittery however when you get these beautiful plants home all that is gone so that is it for today's plant haul hope to see you guys very soon until then keep gardening and also do not forget to subscribe like and share until we meet again a very warm goodbye